This is the story of Ted Ramiratron. My purse! My purse! Don't worry ma'am, we'll take care of this. Don't let him get away. Fuck him! Ah, get the fuck off me! Shut the fuck up! What's with the fridge, pig? Can it flesh you or I'll mace your ass. Here. Thank you. What's the matter, Clink? Ain't got your sound card checked? Look here, Punk. If I wanted my comeback, I'd wipe it off your chin. Now move it, meatbag. Here you are, ma'am. Thank you so much. We're just doing our job. Let's get the hell out of here. All right. Do you know who my father is? Uh, I'm sorry, I don't hang around the red light district too often. Hey, John. <laughs> take this motherfucker down to lockup. Paperwork, I guess. Yeah. Here at the precinct, Ted's fine police work goes unappreciated. He is ridiculed for being a robot. Listen, you dirty bad bolts. You think you can get shot and have some respect around here? Well, it's not gonna happen. Yeah, you fucking toaster. Ladies, in my office right now. What's up, Chief? Shut the shit, we got work to do. I'm gonna give you boys some serious work to do. None of that pussy street shit anymore. We, we are working with a real serious robot killer. Now, Remitron, I'm not putting you on this because you're a robot. I'm putting you on because you're a damn good cop. There's been four killings in the Roxbury area so far. I don't want it to be a fifth one. Do I make myself perfectly clear? Yes, sir. Yeah, you boys did pretty good today. Why don't y'all take the rest of the day Upon off, receiving their new assignment, they went to visit their informant. Hey, Hernandez! Hey, these are my two favorite customers. Hey, baby, go do your thing. I haven't seen you boys in a little while, man, haven't I? Shut your filthy mouth! Whoa, whoa, cool, man. He said, cool. shut it, pussy peddler. We want to know something. Oh, man, this is bad for business. Real bad for business. Wise up, punk, or we'll make things really bad for business. All right, all right, I know what you boys want. You boys looking for a good time? Cut the shit, dickhead. We want some information. Some sick fuck on the streets killing robot children. What do you know about it? Whoa, I don't know nothing, man. I'm small time. If I talk, he'll kill me. Bitch, I'll kill you! Whoa, be cool, man. Be cool. Word on the Through intense interrogation, Ted and Dron were able to locate the suspect. Well, I guess you're not totally useless. Against his better judgment, Ted went out after the murderer alone. He found him exactly where Hernandez said he would be outside of the book depository. Hey man, can I bum a cigarette? Yeah, now that's gonna do you any good. Alright, I'll skip the bullshit you selling around. Who's asking? A man with a plan. Alright. Yeah man, I can hook you up. Sorry about that, you uh, you don't exactly fit the description of a spot spying quality show. What do you mean? Let's just say that I uh, I deal with a much younger crowd. <laughs> you know man, if you wanna get like, really fried, I got this thing you might be interested in. Tell me more. We're doing this little, uh, experiment, if you will. We got this new ram from over in Korea. This shit'll fry your motherboard. So, uh, think you want to help me out? Put your hands on your head. You ain't got shit on me, Clank. I said put your fucking hands on your fucking head. Christ, Ted! I'm okay. Go get him. This is for Ted, you racist child molester. Ted! Ted, are you alright, buddy? It's okay, Ron. I'm ready. Don't give me that shit, Ted. Don't give me that shit. It's gonna be alright. Let's get you back at the station. Let's get you to the medics. Come on. I'm not going anywhere. I will be dying here tonight. 
Goodbye, Ron. You've been a good for a half for a half for The murderer's reign of terror had come to an end, but only after he had claimed his fifth and final victim. My brother. Ted.